And with just hours left now in 2018, you are looking at video from our helicopter high above the Las Vegas Strip, where hundreds of thousands of revelers will ring in the new year. They'll be watching fireworks launch from the city's casino resorts, attend star-studded performances, raise their glasses for a champagne toast, and there's just about, uh, oh, seven hours left now in the new year in this current year, but the countdown to 2019 has already begun. From 8 tonight until 12.35 a.m., 8 News Now is bringing you live team coverage of celebrations around the world for our annual award-winning New Year's Eve program. And before it all kicks off, though, let's take a look at how Las Vegas is preparing for what's expected to be the city's largest New Year's Eve party ever. Darlene Melendez has a look at the items that people are buying to help them ring in the new year. Karen Castro is live near New York, New York, with how authorities plan to keep the city safe tonight. But first, Patrick Walker is live above the fray at the Hard Rock Cafe, the center stage for our coverage of, Quint of Countdown to 2019, live from Las Vegas. Hi there, Patrick. Hi there, Denise and Christiane. Yeah, you mentioned that uh, seven hours now in the countdown. We're the ones counting, right? Coming up to the stroke of midnight, we have quite a party in store. It's a relative calm before the storm. I want to show you what it looks like behind me. Fairly calm, but compared to last year, we've actually seen a lot more people who have been out and about, just kind of milling around on the sidewalk, taking in the sidewalk sights and sounds and enjoying things here as we count down to the final hours of 2018. The view fantastic and really preparing for this has been a pretty monumental effort. Work has been underway in earnest since yesterday to get crowd control measures in place. Clark County setting up 4,000 pedestrian barricades, about six miles worth of fence panels. There are hundreds of porta potties being set up along the strip as well. And the semi-permanent road closure barricades that we're used to seeing, they're back up on the streets that feed off onto Las Vegas Boulevard. Boulevard. Planning for all of this happens almost as soon as the previous year's celebrations wrap up. Something revelers appreciate as they prepare to party away 2018 and welcome 2019. I'm looking for movie stars. I know they're going to be out here. Like so. It's already been advertised. <laughs> so we're going to be looking to see who's out here. Who's who? They're saying like 375,000 people. It's good to be back tonight. We're looking forward to it. That's why we're here. <laughs> we flew in and we're going to be here and we're going to celebrate. Well, after the party, crews get down and dirty. An army of workers from the Public Works Department will hit the streets to collect roughly 15 tons of garbage that's left behind. It's all blown out to the middle of the street where a fleet of a few dozen street sweepers really just come and suck it all up. But let's not worry about that right now. We are just a few hours away from our coverage here on Channel 8. We hope you all tune in, and we will be with you all the way through midnight when all of the fireworks kick off off of the buildings here up and down the Strip. Christiane.